I talked about one of the most eloquent voices were those of veterans. We have with us today at the beginning of the march Veterans for Peace. And Gloria Davidson is one of those leaders here of a very large and growing Veterans for Peace movement with chapters all across this country. And she is not only going to give the message about peace, but how we fund the peace movement. Ladies and gentlemen, people of peace, I bring you greetings from San Diego Veterans for Peace. I am very proud to have evolved into a veteran for peace, and I am very proud to be able to call Kenyon Ralph, president of Iraq Veterans Against the War, a friend and a member also of Veterans for Peace. It is so good to see you here today, all of you. It is so good to see you here today. It is especially good to see so many young people here today. You do my heart proud. I am so happy. The last time I saw some of you was at a rally a few months ago, and it's been too long. But since that rally, I can certainly say bye-bye, Blackwater. Join me. Yes, indeed. Bye-bye, Blackwater. Now, I am the eternal optimist, and I still believe that I'm going to have a chance to say bye-bye, Bush. I do. But there are things we need to do. We have paid for war. We have paid for the piss-poor priorities of the pathetic president. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We need now to pay for peace. It is an ongoing process, and it needs our pecuniary participation. So now is the time. Among you, you will see the pillowcases for peace. The pillowcases for peace. We have paid for war. We've paid for those pathetic policies. I'm going to ask you now to dig deep and help us pay for peace and the process, the ongoing process that is peace. Funds will go to the San Diego Coalition for Peace and Justice, and funds will go to the Peace Resource Center, and in turn, they will disperse funds to all the other peace organizations. The pillowcases from peace are fanning out now among you. Please, people, the process is not over. We have said bye-bye, Blackwater. We can say bye-bye, Bush, but we still need to dig deep now for the peace process. The election is not until November, and Bush, if we let him, will stay in there till January. There is much work to be done. We appreciate your presence. We appreciate your perseverance. Please participate now and dig deep to pay for peace. The investment you make for peace is for you and me and our children and our grandchildren. We've heard the facts. We've heard the statistics. It is appalling. It is absolutely appalling what we have paid for the pathetic policies of the pathetic president of the United States. We know that he is out of touch. We know that he is out of control. We know that he needs to be out of office, and we need to continue to do our part. Please, please, please dig into your pockets, and let's pay for peace, and the funds will go for good things in the peace community to make the message of peace spread further so that we can be heard. We have said bye-bye, Blackwater. We can still say bye-bye, Bush, but we need your help. Thank you for being here. You are powerful. You are important. I want to see your faces every time because you make me proud. Thank you.
Florida Davis and Vets for Peace.